Hello everyone and welcome back to Star Stable Online! We are finally back and it has been a little while and I am so sorry for that you guys. I was away on vacation which you can totally find out from our update vlogs. So if you ever wonder, Siri, where's Star Stable? Be sure to check out the update vlogs because I was so touched at how many of you missed Autumn Promised and Melanie Warrior and Rose Stone and all of our other horses and how many of you were so excited to see our reaction to some of the amazing new updates like the new Mustang, the gorgeous Christmas tree and of of course the thing that so many of you have been beyond excited about and have been so eager to see the new my stable update and it's finally arrived so i have brought us on over to where our new home stable is here at steve's farm while well, we have been busy 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 running around and doing so many different tasks in the world oh my gosh look there's a new person so this is john and apparently we can speak to him to upgrade all sorts of things inside of our new stable so without further ado let's Let's go ahead and head on inside. Are you guys ready for this? <gasps> Look at that! Oh, that's such a cute little picture. Welcome to your new stable. You can put your horses in your new box stalls where you can easily reach them. If you don't have any free box stalls left in your stable, the remaining horses will be put in your inventory. There are many, oh, their names go on the box stalls. That's so cool. There are many different box stalls available and each one can be assigned to a horse. Follow these instructions to activate a box stall. Go to the box stall, click the sign with the name of the box stall. This will open your inventory where you can choose which horse you would like to place in the box stall. Got it. And that's, that's John, I believe. And most of that is not in a language I understand. So wonderful, John. Talk to John to upgrade your stable. John is standing outside the stable. You can find more information about the stable and how it works in the menu next to the map. All right, so that's wonderful. And look at this, you guys, this is so pretty. There's so many windows and there's so much sunlight coming in from all directions. Oh my gosh. This is gorgeous. I just want to like put all of my cats up to sit in the hay up there. <gasps> look, there's Rose Stone. Rose Stone, there you are. And so Horse Island is now gone, you guys. And in place, we have these stables and we have a pasture now. And there's Silver Secret. Look at them. And they all have their saddle pets with them. This looks so beautiful. This whole place is for me. Oh my gosh. And here's our beautiful Rose Stone. Is she just sitting? Here's Autumn Promises stable box. Okay. <gasps> Look at that. And you can just come on in. All right, Autumn Promise. You hang out in here for a minute. Can I go ahead and get off you? There you go. You hang out in here. It looks like all of my horses are at top tier happiness right now too, which is really wonderful. Amethyst Mist is doing well. Rose Stone. Do you not have a stable box? Let's see. Wait, why does Autumn Promise have two stable boxes? All right, what if I could make this Rose Stone stable box? We'll have to see what's going on. All right, so what if, okay, so this is our inventory now. Now you have the option of choosing the horses you want in your stable. You can move a horse from your inventory to your stable by dragging your horse's icon on the box for the box stall and dropping it there. Okay, so Autumn Promise is listed here, but what if I want to put Melody Warrior back here. Look at that, Melody Warrior. It has been so long since we've seen you because you have been far, far, far away over at the Horse Island for so long. You guys, this is our very first horse, Melody Warrior. Do you remember him? Oh man, it's been a while. They all talk about Melody Warrior like it's a him, but I always thought Melody Warrior was a girl, personally. All right, so it looks like Rose Stone needs to have her own spot. So Autumn Promise does not have a spot here. Yeah, Rose Stone goes there so that's always reserved for the horse we're currently riding gotcha so then if we want to put in autumn promise we can come over here so fire lord we'll put right here hey fire lord oh my gosh look at all my horses i'm surrounded by so many wonderful horses this is so amazing oh and i forgot how silver secret's still wearing his halloween gear too that's so cool and then we can come over here and we can go ahead and put Autumn Promise in. Ah, oh, I love seeing them all with their saddles and their saddle pets on too. Like they're ready to go at a moment's notice for any kind of adventure we might have for them. This is just, this is just awesome. This is just fantastic. I mean, it's so beautiful just to see all of the horses out at once. All right, all right, all right. Come on, Rose Stone. Let's bring you up a little bit closer and we can close the box maybe for Melanie Warrior. Not sure how we can do that. We'll figure it out. All right, come on, Rose Stone. And we'll move Rose Stone forward. Okay, so you just kind of move away from that area and then the box closes. 
Also, sorry if I sound really, really weird. I have a tremendously terrible, terrible cold right now. <gasps> wow! All these different rooms open up and you can see all your cleaning gear. Man, it's too bad you can't invite people into your stables. That would be so much fun. To be like, hey, come check out all my horses. Look at all the gear, all the tack up on the walls. This is so cool. All right, let's come on out. This actually looks a lot like an exceptionally clean and newer version of the horse stables at the university that I went to that we used to sneak into all the time to help out my friends who were taking equestrian sciences. All right, so this would be where we can fill up for water. And now the buckets hold up to 12 bits of water at a time, which is really nice. And there's just all sorts of little rags. I mean, look at this. It's so cute. I wish you could have people over so you could all just sit and enjoy what the stable has to offer. And we have so much room. Oh, what's this? Is this going to tell me some news? The stable hair care and the appearance change, stable care help, um, all sorts of that information. We should probably get stable care help soon. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and just set stable care help for a week because I always forget. And then my horses are always sad. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. Yay, now we have a stable girl to help us out. Oh, we should pick one of the stable helpers that are out in the world and say that she's the one who comes and helps us out. Cause that would be really fun. Oh, wow, there's even a bathing area for the horses now. This is so nice. And is this my wardrobe? It kind of looks like a magical wardrobe, like for Narnia tucked here at the back. All right, and let's dash over here. Oh, and then you just run right up to it and it will expose all of your stuff for you. Good, okay. So it'll show everything and we've got all of these adorable little pets as well. I really need to get more, some more of the little saddle bags so that my pets, uh, or so that my animals who have pets can be able to be seen. I should definitely give a pet to Melanie Warrior. You know what, let's do that. Let's go ahead and let's get this spotty seal, or I wonder if I should get the seal with the cowlick. Let's get the seal with the cowlick and this old bag out and I'm pretty sure that Fire Lord actually has a saddle pet with him so I want to make sure because look at how fun that is to go through and you can see just everybody is all dolled up ready to go and I'm pretty sure Melanie Warrior here actually has okay come here come here for a second Melanie Warrior I could have sworn you had a pet with you my friend okay and then we'll go ahead and add in can I put a little saddle bag on Hmm, that's for blanket. Is that for saddlebag? Where's saddlebag? Reins, leg wraps. Tell oh, down here. That's silly of me. Okay, saddlebag. And we'll give the curly cute little, little seal. And then the beautiful seafaring saddle. You can wear that for now, my friend, my old friend. You can go ahead and wear this Melody Warrior. So that way you can enjoy having an adorable seal with you because I don't want Melody Warrior to be lonely. Oh, that's so nice. Let's go get uh, Fire Lord a saddle as well. It can be any of our random decorative saddles. And that's a great way to just kind of show off your gear. I, I'm getting why people think it would be so much fun just to do, uh, should we do the brown saddle? probably the brown saddle for him and maybe well let's see what else do we have star saddle gray field racing saddle the witch saddle uh let's see what those look like on him and then i think like the gray farm blanket might be good for fire lord and we can and i'm pretty sure he has his little pig general iro the pig i'm pretty sure he has that with him right now so let's pop on the fire lord oh you're only level two i'll have to level you up one day yeah, look, he has General Iro with him. And he's already got a saddlebag and everything. So that's the brown hurricane saddle. Oh, the gray field saddle looks really good on him. But not so much the blanket. I forgot how the blanket has flowers on it. All right, sorry about that, Fire Lord. I'll be sure to bring you uh, some new things in the future. But this would make saddle tours, not saddle tours. What am I saying? This would make stable tours so much fun now. Just to be able to walk down and check in on everybody. And to have so many beautiful horses to be able to see. And I know you guys are so excited because there has been another new gorgeous horse added into Star Stable with the Mustang. So I definitely will be trying to check out the Mustang very soon. I mean, look at all these saddles. Look, or the saddles, I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm very sick. I have a cold right now, so I may not make that much sense. Look at all of these stable boxes. This is amazing. There's so many places that I could just come in and stick horses. It actually makes me want to kind of get some more horses, especially if I can figure out how to do the live streaming thing and we can start doing our training days at least once a month. That would be really cool. All right, now what's over here? So that's to exit the stable. 
Now I do have another question though, because we're supposed to be able to put our horses out into, let's see, stable, stable, talking to people, my stable. And then you should be able to put your horse out into the pasture. Move a horse from the pasture to a box stall by dragging the horse icon and dropping it in front of the box in the box stall. Uh, in the pasture. If, oh, there we go. Okay, okay. Here we go. Uh, activate a box stall. This will open the pasture where you can choose which horse you want to put in the box stall. It, in the pasture, you have the choice of keeping which horse you want to keep in your stable. All right, so you can't see the pasture, even though I think that would be amazing if you could see the pasture. And then I guess both of those are just exits. Guys, what do you think? What do you think of the My Stable update? Because this is, I mean, I feel like I'm living the high life now. I'm sort of spoiled, surrounded with this awesomeness. All of my horses get a nice little place to relax. I, I apparently have gained much fame and acclaim. Oops, sorry about that. I'm trying to like line up for a nice little picture. I've gained much fame and acclaim in this uh, beautiful island. And now all of my horses have their saddle pads too, which is really important if you ask me. That way they won't get lonely. They've got plenty of beautiful pets to keep them occupied too. Oh, this is so pretty. And Rosestone, you have such a gorgeous thing. Okay, yeah, this is going to be really, really wonderful. Oh, it's so pretty. All right, so enough enough of my poking around. Sorry, I'm just trying to get like a good angle on pictures and I feel so, so doozy woozy because I've got a little bit of a cold right now. This is so gorgeous. I just want to climb up there and sleep up there. I bet that's where all of my extra saddle pets go. All right, so that's the beautiful My Stable. I really love it. I hope you guys enjoy it too. It does make me want to get some more horses. And let's go over and talk to John now. So John. Hi, Saga. Lovely day, isn't it? Ah, just lovely. If I'm being honest, I'm feeling a bit fidgety. There's not a lot to do around here. But maybe that's why you're here, Saga. Are you here to upgrade your stable? All right. And then if you pay him star coins, what you can do is you can continue to upgrade to level, I think, five all the way up. So upgrade to level one. So it's not even a level one stable yet. And if we add in that, then we'll have a total of 14 boxes. Oh my gosh, what would I even do with that many boxes? And I also saw, I'm not sure if you could do this before, but you can now sell your horses if you so choose. Um, you can have a lot of horses still. They'll just go out into the pasture instead of off to Horse Island. So I guess that makes it even more important to make sure that you have your stable care going all of the time. So really, maybe I should just invest in like, some really good stable care at some point in the future but that's interesting all right so we don't need to really expand right now but that's who we would talk to john right here in case we ever needed to make the my stable continue to grow i really like it i really like it oh and i got rose stone out without even noticing that i was really picking her but i'm happy to see her too because not only has the my stable update come out not only are there mustangs we're going to have to go and investigate but we also have christmas coming and look at all this christmas stuff there's just christmas stuff all over the place oh look at all these candy canes there's so many candy canes oh rose stone i forgot how fast rose stone is you guys wow after riding our new pony around Rose Stone in a good mood is just amazing. So there's a lot of Christmas things to do. And now you can help Santa with doing little Christmas wishes. And if you gather up the different pieces of a Christmas wish and put them together, then you'll actually be able to get like special items. Is that Santa? No. Okay. I was so confused for a second. I was like, no way is that Santa. All right. So there's special items you can buy. There's a Christmas blanket. I don't think it's, oh, there we go. There's a Christmas. Oh, wow. There's so much stuff. It just all showed up at once. Christmas trousers. Oh, Christmas shoes. There's Christmas gloves. Oh, the cute little Christmas blanket. Roaster, are you going to feel super festive? Maybe she can have like a new decorative piece for her hair. A Christmas sweater. Fun fact, my beloved chips, the love of my life. Oh, this is so cute. The little red Christmas dress. I want it. We might get that soon. Oh, this is so adorable. We should dress up in a nice little Christmas outfit before we start roaming around, searching and, and hunting down all of the little Christmas wishes. That's going to be a really fun thing to do next time. Look at all of this. Oh, this is so cool. Okay, that's beautiful. Absolutely stunning and beautiful. Let's come over here. And then what do we have? Yep beautiful sweater really fun sweater oh my gosh all right we'll definitely poke around this some more but i need to figure out where santa is located and i can't remember oh my gosh where he is the councilman also has a few choice things to say 
What is that? That's new. Is that to like set up some Christmas decorations? But yeah, there's going to be Christmas wishes. And when you gather up all of the pieces of the Christmas wishes, then you can get a random amount of gifts given to you. Kind of like a lot of the other random things that we can do. Is that a sleigh? No, that's the tractor going. I thought I would see Santa over there for a second. So I'll have to figure out where to find Santa. And we'll have to start doing the amazing Christmas quest in a little bit. Look at that! Now the guy that's always- No, remove Rosestone! Now the guy that's always been honking at me is actually here. And here is the horse market. That's awesome. So this is going to be really fun, you guys. I hope you enjoy my stable. I hope it's everything. Oh, I'm sorry, Rosestone. I thought we'd be able to do that okay. I hope it's everything that you guys have been waiting for for so long. I know that it's been super, super, super a huge, huge, huge source of excitement for so many of you. And I just hope you're going to enjoy it too. And maybe you can share some amazing pictures of your stables. And I have to admit, seeing all of my horses in a comfy big stable like that with so much more room to add more members into the family... It does kind of make me feel like I'm uh, I'm in the mood to actually potentially look at that Mustang. So I have to say that's unexpected of me. All right, Steve, anything fun today? Guess what, Saga? It's Christmas soon again, and there's always so much to do to get ready. There are Christmas trees, food, and decorations, everything you can think of. And all it takes is and it all takes time to get ready for Christmas Day. I'm sure you remember from last year. Actually, I think we started playing right around Christmas because you guys asked for Star Stable last year and it ended up changing the course of so much of my adventures and so much of my life. I am now a lifetime Star Raider because you guys just wanted to sh share your sincere happiness with Star Stable. So thank you so much for that. Oh my gosh, yeah, we weren't here last year. Oh, that's so amazing. So this is yet another one of the holidays that we get to enjoy for the first time together. Uh, remind the councilman in Silverglade that it's probably time to start getting ready. I've already begun to plan, and I know that Will has already redecorated his windmill. He's always a bit early with that kind of thing. All right, so let's go ahead and remind the councilman really quickly that, hey, guess what? It's almost Christmas. And then next time, we'll have to spend some time hunting down the Christmas quest and starting those and spending a little bit of time looking at all of the details. Just as I mentioned, I'm really sick. So I'm just excited that we got to be together long enough to look at the My Stable. And the new kitten! Oh, and he's got a little puppy right there, too. Hello, Saga. Of course I know it's time to get ready for Christmas. Steve doesn't have to worry. I'm thinking of starting the preparations tomorrow. Same procedure every year. As you can see, I'm already wearing my Christmas hat. Oh no? It can't wait till tomorrow? All right, you seem so eager. We better start right away then. All right, so we will help out the councilman and we will go and we will gather up all of those Christmas wishes next time. So thank you guys so much. Let me know what you think about my stable and I will see you all next time. Bye-bye.